Well, a frightening morning for a teenager just walking to school. Police say a, pol uh, a man actually attacked her. Yeah, detectives actually tracked that suspect down and they say he's done this before. ABC Action News reporter Maricela Burgos is live in Haines City with how she got away. Maricela? That young girl did exactly what her parents taught her to do. She fought back. It was 640 this morning when she was walking over there on that sidewalk. The chief says a man got close to her, said hi, kept walking, but turned around and started following her. This happened near the intersection of East Grace Avenue and 21st Street in Haines City. She crossed the street to get away from him, but detectives say he kept following her and then attacked her on the grass, but she screamed and punched him back, escaping a person who lives nearby heard her screams. Clearly the guy had his hands around her neck. That's how he got her to the ground. So there is no question this is the real deal. It does not get more real than this. Detectives immediately started investigating. This is who they say attacked that 15 year old girl. The chief says 22 year old Tristan Calixi was locked up and had recently gotten out on probation. He says he attacked another young girl a few summers ago. The chief says he punched a 14 year old girl walking on a trail. I'm told he will face various charges, including kidnapping. Now this investigation is far from over. Detectives want any witnesses that were in this area to call them immediately. Specifically, they say there was a woman driving a van that was around here shortly after that attack happened and they want her to contact them. Reporting live, Maricela Burgos, ABC Action News.